There's a big push lately to hit driver on the upswing and to loft up with your driver. The whole reasoning for that is try to try and eliminate spin on the ball. What if you could eliminate spin without having to hit up on the ball? Because here's the problem with having to hit up on the ball with driver, but then hitting down on the ball with all your other clubs. You have to make two swings, and one swing is hard enough to make in this game. So making two swings, I think, puts too much burden on you, and I also know that it's unnecessary, because you can eliminate spin by just making a shallow swing path. The whole reasoning behind uh, reducing spin in the modern swing is that the modern swing creates too much spin. Well, what if you're running a different path? What if you're using a different swing that runs this shallow path here? Well, this shallow path immediately reduces spin on the ball. And a shallow path is one that travels from the inside out. So you know your ball flight is going to be a tight draw. So reducing spin doesn't mean you have to change your swing. It should just be something that is a product of a good swing. Because you can set into your forward side, anchor yourself, create power, and reduce spin all at the same time. This will allow you to make one swing for driver all the way down through sand wedge and never have to make adjustments throughout the course.